Welcome back to East Origin. We are Hugo. Hi. We're actually standing right outside the door to the Mantis boss, and last time we got a little bit of demon in us. Hasn't affected gameplay in any notable way, and I want to know what we do if we regret this decision. Does it do something with the boost? You haven't done boost yet. That's true. I don't think it does anything, though. Like, I legitimately don't think it's anything. I think it's just plot. Nah. But like Dallas said, hey, I can give you this as a trial, and if you like it, you can go full demon. And like, okay, cool, but what if I don't like it? I'm, am I just stuck like this, or can I, can I go back? I don't think you're going back. Yeah. Anyway, um... Mantis boss coming up. Not looking forward to it, because we don't have the range that Unica had, shockingly for being the mage versus the axe wielder. So, I don't know at all what we're doing here, but I'm thinking bombs may be good when against, like, the horde of little guys. Maybe. Otherwise, like, I just kind of have to get close-ish and shoot him. Yeah, that's a little... Okay, so I think this is what got me before. Uh, you see how he swings his wand? Whenever I shoot, mm -hmm. if I jump when he's swinging his wand, it just eats the jump. Because it's still playing the animation. Yeah. Even though, like, I've already shot, I should be able to jump. But you can't. And that has hecked me over more times than I can count. But anyway, um, so as usual, I expect to die a lot, so we'll see what happens. I also grinded just a couple levels. We are 42 now. The enemies gave a lot of experience, so I figured I was probably behind. Was it? That feels a little different. Yeah, I don't remember it being so... I jumped. Gruesome. Ow. Not really sure what I was intended to do about that. Run! You have bombs. It's sure. just chasing it. I had to do bombs. I think I just did I don't like having to get this close to this guy. Ah, I went out! Does some. I'm more concerned about using the bomb against the bees. Guys. You know if I can get him. Thankfully, I think that grinding did us pretty good. Got some of them. Yeah, I think that grinding did us pretty good, because we're not getting wrecked too hard. Which is nice. I don't want to just kill all of them. Ow. 
ow, 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 ow. Thank you. I got most of them, if not all of them. Hold up, let me wreck. Oh no, he's just making more babies. Don't make babies, don't make babies, don't make babies! Just die! Yeah! It's the first time you one shot at a boss. It's that time when you. I've one shot at most of them as Hugo. Except, you know, Caterpillar. Oh, yeah. It's the end of the boss fight when you just ignore mechanics and try to burn them down. Mm. And then usually die. You have to eat it. Eat his corpse. I got like half my HP left. I'm fine. Let's go. Did it do this for Unica or Nope, he no. died. Ah, we're going we're going demony. Oh, never mind, I just boosted by accident. No, when you boost, you only get four eyes, you're up to six. Demon boost. Wait, do I have to, like, actually fight him? Oh, I gotta fight him. Well, at least you're full healed. I can actually die, which is the hilarious thing. Why don't you try your abilities? Uh... You're not even using boots, that's the fun thing, it's actually charged up. Got fire torn down. In there... I don't know, my abilities haven't really changed at all. What am I boots? Nothing. I thought you get eight eyes. So it didn't look like the abilities changed much at all. It was just kind of your base shot now had six guys. Yeah, careful, dude, you're... Your demon's showing a little. You know, kind of hard to, kind of hard to read when I mean, you can't capitalize right, and the red text is also not especially easy to read. Now well, the capitalization is basically just the, this is how far gone he is, but the red text is not helping with the blue background. Yeah, like I mean, I, black like, I, I get the intention, but I only sort of know what you're saying. You didn't want to charge up the fire one, did you? I did! And it didn't do that. Yeah, you're going a little demon there, friend. Hmm. Heck was that? Power hungry. 
Yeah. Dallas knew how to manipulate a guy who was emotionally unstable. I didn't think we got Darth Vader. It's literally how we got Darth Vader. He was emotionally unstable and got manipulated while at his lowest peak. You know, you got six of those. Oh, there we go. You're aiming pretty slow there, friend. <sighs> oh, you're not playing to use the windshield. He can toggle between them faster than I can. Admittedly, this would make for a pretty cool boss fight. Where you played as her against him? Yeah. The way he's, like, putting the eyes around like that. You could come up with some interesting mechanics around that. Could you just walk over there and kick him in the face for me? I kind of miss Unica at this point. She was a lot more cheerful. Yeah. We'll see how it goes, but I don't know. There's. I kind of liked you, uh, Hugo early on. I liked his straightforwardness, but like as the game has gone on, he has become more Sasuke. Yeah. What's Unica then? Sakura or Naruto? Unica? I don't know. She doesn't have the arrogance to be Naruto. I think when you play through as her, she's Naruto. Because she has some kind of self-doubt issues. She's kind of the opposite spectrum hmm. of what Naruto does. Where Naruto's Hiding his pain and suffering with his overconfidence, but then Unica Unica's, actually is just yeah. Unica's just got the you know lack of confidence, and it really shows until like near the end. But in this playthrough, she's the Sakura because nobody cares about her. I mean, honestly, yeah. Like, when was the last time Unica did anything of value other than like cry over the fact that everybody else was turned to stone? I mean, she went and got that statue, I guess. Yeah. Hugo, you're an idiot. See, there he goes again, just saying it. 
with the second goddess in my grasp. It's like, all right, well, he got her sometime. I swore she left with them in Unicos. Yeah, I don't remember that at all in Unicos. I'm trying to think if it was Rhea or Fina who did it. Because I think Fina's the one who left with them willingly, and that's why she's stuck in the annex. But Rhea was just like, I guess, hey, how you doing? I'm going to go try to take care of stuff with this black pearl. Oopsie daisy. Yeah, like the last time we saw her was when Hugo, or when she gave that item to Hugo. Yeah, in the same the place. Things. And then we just get a text box that says, by the way, I got her. Maybe in Toll's playthrough. Yeah, maybe. You know, now that I think about it, what I've read up, it probably will make more sense in that one. Yeah. So this is our equivalence to... Roy. Our boy. I bet he still dies on Unica somehow. <laughs> I like the black bars disappearing as if, <laughs> if like, eh, back to widescreen. <laughs> Hugo, you're an idiot. You're a demon. Well, a dark thing, but still. Actually, I did just crumble to dust. I mean, Alice is a dick. I mean, yeah. Now take her Triton and actually have a rain oh, melee weapon. But better yet. Figure out how to channel electricity into that thing and give yourself a ranged weapon. Also because we don't know how to program in a company new people. I or mean, we just didn't bother. We could probably do it if we tried real hard. I mean, again, with Adol, it's mostly a single character journey thing, so... Yeah. Apparently the later games get, like, party members and stuff, though. I don't know if it's, like, it goes on more of an action RPG thing and they just kind of follow around and be helpful, or what. Mm hmm You know, I've probably mentioned before that it bothered me a little bit that Final Fantasy has gone the action RPG route, because, like, that's our old turn-based RPG. That's what it was forever, and what we knew it for. But, like, East, it's always kind of been action RPG-ish. So, like, it goes action RPG, that's right in line with what it wants to do. I think the argument can be made that you could basically say Final Fantasy was kind of getting a little more action-y since the fourth game because of the active time bar. Yeah. I mean, they've, like, been slowly creeping it up, with, like, with the active time bar and um, that, but... I almost feel like that kind of general thing... 
I don't know if that's them wanting to move, move towards something like they've always wanted to do that and they're just now getting the chance or what. I don't know. Just gonna leave these here? Oh, I thought this was a, like a sp little spear too, but it's just a part of the triangle. That's her trying. I mean, this is. I meant this over here. Oh. And I, I want to apologize to the viewers because I have trouble taking that kind of scene seriously. I think it's I, I think it's just um, my own inter interest in what I'm going what I go through as you grow older, but like. I feel like if I were younger, I feel like if I were still like a teenager, that would be, that would feel pretty important. But I'm like 35 at this point. There's personal taste too, like that kind of thing is something that I, I think I used to appreciate more. How badly do I just give him that? Not bad, actually. I was probably under-leveled when I came through here as a unit. I can just kind of destroy him now. You went out of your way to grind for the Mantis boss, too. So. Yeah, and I'm kind of glad I did, because I feel like that could have been a horrible fight. No, I meant for Unica. Uh, not for the Mantis. Not for the Mantis? No. I'm confused. What the crap? You can do that? Because I grinded right here as mm. Unica. Oh, I made it. Dude. I mean, I probably should have double jumped. It's probably the road of fruit. Yeah. Okay, and the uh, the rue is like on the, the next room or so. I just love grouping together like 40 guys and melting them. How you doing, buddy? I completely forget what you give me. Oh, you give me the boost thing! The burst thing, yes. The demons around here are merciless. My cuteness is my shield. But you are an ugly human, so you may be in, so you may be in trouble. I think I may die soon if I do not get food in my stomach. Oh, woe is me. Sweats. Calling me ugly? For true? Shocked. My eyes, they overflow with tears of joy. I must thank you for this with all my heart and with my power. My tears, they I know. flow like waterfalls. I read that and I was like, oh, he's going to make that Pedro reference we haven't <laughs> done in years. Burst. Oh, wow, yours is not... Um, That's different, yeah. That was like a demonic burst. Um, when in boost mode, press the boost key a second time, and do a thing. From me to you, man of hue, on behalf of Rue, whoop de doo I gotta kick you off of this platform. I bid you well on your journey, my friend. Alrighty. And that's the last one for Hugo. No, I just noticed there's no railing on the stairs. Crap's dangerous. Okay, well, let's go find somebody to use this on, and that'll probably do it for the day. Oh, okay, cool. So I can just run around and murder all. Can I do this too? Yeah! Okay. So it's different from Unica's, because Unica, you're stationary. Okay, I don't think there's a save point in this room. I think this is kind of a bigger, more involved room. So yeah, let's just call it here. And say until next time, everybody.
Uh, next time, we're... Where, where are we? The Demon Core? Yeah, we're almost at the top. Wow. You guys are going quick. I mean, we know what we're doing now. Well, yeah, it's the difference between we know what we're doing and... You know, we just know how to get through so much. Because it's like, what? <sighs> this is floor 23-ish, and it's like floor 24, and then... Then the to top of the tower. Yeah, like, the mirror world is kind of the finale area. Like, you go from there to just the end. Alright, until next time, everybody, we're gonna finish up the Demon Core, head to the mirror world.